What's going on everybody? It's your boy Paulie Black, aka Uncle Paulie. And of course I am the realest fan on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Okay, so it's the 2019 NFL Draft. This is episode four, okay? So we did defensive tackles, we did offensive linemen, we did wide receivers. We got two left. We got running back, we got linebacker. Now let's get into this running back thing, okay? The Eagles are always going to be a running back by committee team. It's cheaper as far as the NFL is concerned. There is a concerted effort in the NFL to diminish the value of this position, okay? Now I could go the uh, standard, um, I guess what you would call, uh, the conspiracy way, you know, I could say that the reason why they're diminishing the position is because it's the only position in the NFL that is 99.998% African American. Okay, I could go that way, but I'm not gonna go that way. The way I'm gonna go is, the reason why I think, and one of the reasons why I think they're diminishing the value of running back in the NFL is because it's the only position whose stats who the bulk of their stats are independent from the quarterback. The quarterback is the number one position in sports. Offensive linemen get paid to protect them. Defenses get paid to stop them. Wide receivers and tight ends get paid to make catches. But the running back, most of the running back stats are rushing, which eliminates the quarterback from getting any stats off of that. So when a quarterback hands the ball off, everybody else can get a stat off of that running back except the quarterback. You can get a tackle, you can get a fumble, a fumble recovery, you can get a tackle for a loss. You can get, everybody else can make stats off of the running back except the quarterback. I think that's very, very interesting when you look at the way the NFL is treating this position. Okay, but with that said, I'm still in fan mode, okay? I was in fan mode for the wide receivers. I was in fan mode, I am in fan mode for running back. So I have three running backs, okay, who I think if you added them on to Jordan Howard with Corey Clement and with a Sproles on his last season, I think that this guy, one of these three guys, could be that catalyst to help Carson and grow with Carson to be the next great combo of quarterback running back in this league, okay? I really, really believe that. Three guys, okay? And these guys embody everything I think a running back should be able to do. He should be able to run, he should be able to block, he should be able to catch, he should be able to uh, pick up, you know, pick up the blitz. I look at running backs and I think a running back should be Brian Westbrook. I love Shady McCoy. I mean, he's been an Eagles fan my whole life. I didn't get to see Wilbur Montgomery, but I saw everybody after him. I saw Heath Sherman, I saw Keith Byers, I saw Ricky Waters, I saw Charlie Garner, I saw Deuce Staley, I saw Carell Buckhalter, I seen Shady. In my personal opinion, Brian Westbrook is the greatest running back to ever wear an Eagles jersey. And I say that and I substantiate that by asking one question. What couldn't Brian Westbrook do? I wait. He could do everything. He could pick up the blitz. He could take a carry to the house anytime he touches the ball. He could leak out into the flat, take a five yard screen, 65, 70 yards. On more than one occasion, number 36 bailed five's ass out on more than one occasion, okay? So like I said, in my opinion, Brian Westbrook is the greatest running back in Eagles history. And I want my next running back to embody those tools that Brian Westbrook had. Now he doesn't have to be a punt returner like B. West was. I'm not asking him to do that. But what I want him to be able to do is catch the ball, pick up blocks, and be able to re-react 
hit those holes, not too much dancing, hit the hole, accelerate. That's all I want. So these three guys that I'm about to give you right now, I think embody the spirit of Brian Westbrook. And if those guys are smart and they get drafted by Philadelphia, you might want to have a sit down with number 36, okay? Because he'll tell you about his fan base and he'll tell you what you need to do to have a solid career, a prolonged career, and a productive career in Eagles Green. Check these backs out. Remember, the highlight reels are going to be down in the link. The links for the highlights are going to be down in the subscription box. So when you hit that like button, you hit the subscribe button, check the links out. Highlight reel. Holla at your boy one time. Peace.